Hello there! Once again, we're with Granny and Friends. Oh, by the way, this is Professor Nigel, Granny's nephew. He's going to be with us today, and we are going to be making our blueberry cream cheese steenish. <laughs> uh, oh, let me introduce our ingredients first. We yeah. <coughs> pardon. We have some Duncan Hines Comstock blueberry in a can. It's fresh fruit type of a thing. And we're going to be putting this in our wonderful dish. Then you'll be needing a quarter cup and a cup measuring cup. And um, you'll be needing a stick of butter, and we're going to be melting this, but you need a little can or something. And then you'll need two little things of cream cheese. About um, two uh, to eight ounces cream cheese. Uh, uh, this is our cream cheese here. Yeah. These here are our crescent rolls. We're going to be using this for our Danish layer. So we'll need two of these. Right? And then we'll be needing sugar. A cup of sugar. And uh, for our, we'll also be needing a quarter cup of sugar too. Alright. And then now we'll need a big bowl. A bowl you can do a lot of mixing in. Uh, a spatula. And a... Uh, Oh, about a pretty big pan. Uh, what is this one? Oh, well, it's a nice pan, nice size. All right. Now we'll first start by taking our crescent roll. Um, and I'm going to kind of pitch it 
together a little bit more. Cause sometimes it falls apart. Since you know, you know, dough. <laughs> and um, today we're gonna put our blueberries on top of our cream cheese, making nice some blueberries. <laughs> our cream cheese and sugar. We mix that up to a beautiful consistency. Right. So you have here more of like an icing. It may not be too um liquidy, but it's going to be a little bit like an icing consistency. If you've baked a cake before, which I hope you have, um, that's what it's like. Wonderful tasting, but I'm not going to eat it for you. <laughs> All right. So now that we have it, we are going to um, take our uh, uh, consistency cake and we're going to uh, pound it into our dish. And we're just going to spread it around and cushy, cushy. One cup of blueberry into um into our mix in our uh, mixture with our cream cheese. So I'll just put it in and mix it around, Professor. Our 
our now finished project is right here. Um, it will look like this when it comes out of our oven. Um, we're, we're going to let it cool. You actually just let it cool for 30 minutes before you serve because otherwise it's too runny. So, um, just um, be sure to cool it for a little while before you serve and it will taste scrumptious. Oh, I just had a wonderful time today with you, Professor Nigel. Thank you for helping me. You're welcome. Watching a Grammy and Friends. Come again next time. Stay tuned.